Hey YouTube, I'm here again, uh, hopefully with a quick little video for you. Uh, I've got an unboxing. Um, not something that I normally do. I'm uh, always too eager uh, when anything comes through the post to get it open. Um, you know, to keep hold of things to to unbox. But this is something a little bit special. It's uh, it's arrived today. Um, quite a I won't say large, but a sizable package and. Uh, I found on eBay, like I say, and uh, because I knew the chances of me being here at home um, when it was delivered uh, it was very slim that I would be here and I had it uh, shipped to my works address. Normally that wouldn't be a problem, uh, you know, something for the Royal Mail or Parcel Force, the, the depots are quite close by. But I knew this guy was posting via uh, UPS and the local UPS depot to me is about 30, 25, 30 miles away and it's uh, it's a bit of a trek, uh, you know, country lanes and uh, the last time I went there um, to collect a parcel that well, wasn't here when it was uh, delivered um, instead of been there waiting for me to collect they had uh, put it back on the van and put it out for delivery again even though I'd been on the website the, f uh, the previous day to arrange a collection um, somebody screwed up uh, so it was a wasted trip so I thought I'm not going to go through that again I'll get it delivered to me at work so anyway let's get into this so I've, I've already slipped the sides open um, but the top is still sealed uh, Yes, I've, I found this on eBay last Sunday. And it's something I've been looking to get for a long time and they're usually pretty pricey. Um, it's a player and as far as I'm aware there's only three models that were ever released at least to the consumer market that, like I said, that I know of are capable of playing both Blu-ray and HD DVDs and that's hopefully what's in here uh, it also came bundled with a bunch of Blu-rays uh, this is an American machine so it's uh, region A for Blu-rays which is also something that uh, I've been wanting um, but this is hackable it can't be made region free unfortunately but you can change the region on it uh, it actually can be made region free for DVD um, but for Blu-ray if you want to watch a region B you've got to put in a code for region B and then if you want to go back to region A at some point you've got to put in another code for region A so in that sense it's it's region free but it's not completely region free you can't just stick any disc in at any time you've, if you want to change regions you've got to so that you gotta change the code. Um, but I have a 3D Blu-ray player already that I can play UK discs in these be. So this will probably just stick to uh, to region A. Um, I don't have that many region A movies at the moment. Oh no, I've got some more now. Um, so yeah, let's just uh, get this out of the box and then we can carry on. Okay, so we're out of the box. Uh, let's see if we can uh, get through some of this bubble wrap. Uh, can always do with more bubble wrap. Uh, okay, so I don't want to pass anything. So let's get out of the box now. Bubble wrap. shouldn't complain that it's been well packaged. Because I've had players that come through in the past that have been awfully packaged. Mm. Wow. This guy's doing awesome job. 
top of this. on the surface there, it's almost a mirror finish. Right, let's uh, get rid of all this bubble wrap. There we go. This is the LG Super Blue BH200 and it is Blu-ray and HD DVD and of course DVD compatible. This is uh, Region A Blu-ray, Region 1 DVD. Plethora of outputs on the map, which is awesome. <laughs> Times I've seen these plates for sale on eBay. Could have been missing the remote, and even still, they sell you know, hundred pound upwards. And uh, this was listed at buy it now for forty quid, which in itself was an awesome price. And you take into consideration it comes with twelve Blu-rays. None of them are the greatest titles. But the guy put a best offer on. So if something's on eBay, regardless of how good a price it is, if there's a best offer and it's something that I want, I'm going to make an offer before I buy it now. So I shoved in an offer for 25 quid, um, which he said no. Um, unsurprisingly, I wouldn't have accepted that. But then he came back with a counter offer for 30 quid, and that included postage, which I thought. Wow, yes, I'll have that. So, grabbed it. So, yeah, for 30 quid, I was very, very, very pleased. Uh, but I had to also grab this. This came from Amazon, uh, which arrived yesterday. But again, I knew it was going to be too big to uh, come through the letterbox. And I wouldn't be here. But with Amazon, you get them delivered to the local Royal Mail sorting office. So that's what I did. I picked it up this afternoon. Get it out of the box. So for this to work, we need this power converter, which converts. 240 volts down to the uh, US 110 volts which is what this needs it's got a American power cord oh. really really chuffed um, I won't go through the blu-rays in this video uh, I'll uh, do them in the pickups video coming probably tomorrow or Sunday um, I'm going to sign off here now. I might possibly do some more recording when I test this and uh, I'll try it out with uh, different region Blu rays and obviously HD DVDs and different region DVDs as well. Anyway, that's it for this one. Uh, thanks for watching, something a little different, and uh, yeah, I'll catch you next time. Ta -ra.